This movie is based on the true story of Ricky Hill, who with his disabilities made it all the way into Major League Baseball. He has degenerative spinal disease. That is the disability I am referring to. I'm truly sorry if you are offended by any chance. The movie starts with Ricky all mad, throwing away his mitt and his bat. By the way, this is a sport drama movie. So if you don't like either, it's not for you. Anyways, he drives to a church and watches a kid playing baseball by himself with just a stick and stones. The kid is also Ricky, Ricky from the past. From now onwards, it is the story of how the kid grew into the young man who throws away his bat and drives a rusty Mustang. Ricky, I've seen you out there swinging that stick, even when you're suffering pain. But you can't play baseball. You're going to get ridiculed. And you're going to wind up with an injury that you'll never get over. God's going to give you a higher calling. But all I want to do is play. When I swing that bat, I ain't crippled no more. And gone, Senior Ricky Hill. Ricky's father, who is a pastor, played by Dennis Quaid, does not like Ricky playing ball, and also believes that Rick will never make pro. He thinks God wants Ricky to be a preacher just like his dad. The bones are rapidly depleting. It'll be a miracle if you ever walk again. You seen this? Major League trials. You're going to paralyze him. I don't need you filling him full of false hope. He's my son. There is also a girlfriend character who returns when Ricky is about to graduate high school. She and him got separated as children. That's why I said girlfriend returns. All the story arcs, the baseball career, his difficult relationship with his father and his girlfriend, all these arcs end satisfyingly in the end. There were multiple scenes of Ricky in difficult relationship with his father and the resentment. There were also some that shows how much his brother loves Ricky and the sacrifices he is willed to make. All these scenes somehow resonates with the viewers. Adult Ricky is played by Colin Ford, who I believe did a great job. Also need to mention the child actor Jesse Berry playing child Ricky also did amazing. Also, the child actors who played the brother and the sister. I really had a good time watching The Hill. It was definitely time well spent. I personally would give the film a 6.5 to 7 out of 10. If you want to watch it, it's on Netflix. Comment down below what you thought of this movie. By the way, don't forget to like and subscribe. That is if you liked and want to subscribe.